As hell, Kevin ain't sleeping hours. I'm about to take a nap. I'm about to dive in the bed. <laughs> Right now we're heading to the weight room in Villanova. We're heading to Aqua. It was rated the best European fitness center. It has four floors. It's amazing. They have pools, they have saunas, they have uh, CrossFit, they have literally everything. But Villanova, that's the city that I used to play basketball in. So we're going back. I kind of know my way around. After we lift, I'm gonna go shop because I didn't bring any clothes. I want to get that European drip. And then tonight, on cycle, we're gonna rest up. I got a little shorty I'm gonna meet up with later do an interview with her on that because y'all like the Dominican interview. So now we're going to see, you know, what these Spanish girls want and pretty much how you guys can utilize the stuff that they saying so you can work on your game and get some girls when you go to these other countries. Then this weekend is going to be nuts. Hey, we got everything jam packed for you guys. Make sure you guys tap in, hit that like, hit the subscribe button. We're coming out for content for you guys. Let's get it. out in and we just want to let y'all know when y'all are on trips it's very important to prioritize working out because you can easily let yourself go like i'm serious all the drinking and partying your body no sleep no rest your body is just going to be breaking down this is like a part of our life so everything else that we do is kind of like revolves around training working out getting money you know we don't uh stop our grind for nothing even when we're out it may seem like you know we having a great time and that which we are, but mm -hmm. that comes after the fact. That's not something that we wake up and that's the first thing on our mind. We got hella shit we take care of before we we can start up any of those things. You know? Exactly. Um, it starts, and, this, this, and this was something that we built over years. It wasn't something that we just decided one day, oh, let's do this. Like we've been doing this since we was, you know, early twenties. You know, now we're, we're in our late twenties, we're just grinding harder and harder. And it's about knowing your body too. Like we both play ball, we both play college ball, and it's like we uh this mindset of working out it was instilled from basketball, and we just carried it on to our daily lives. So try to use that discipline that you've gotten early on and try to in ingrain it with everything you do. And if you don't have discipline, then work on that. Exactly. Because that's where it all starts. Yep. So, you, know, you could be motivated, right? And that motivation comes in and out, but when you discipline. You don't need motivation because no matter what, in your head you think you gotta get it done. You know, exactly whether you motivated you or not. Yeah, exactly. And if you guys don't have a background on lifting or anything like that, the best day to start is today. So don't look at it as like, damn, I'm out of shape. It's gonna take me forever. Start setting up your stepping stones now. Set the pathway to greatness now. Get ready, get prepared, and then execute. Just like Kevin said, if you are disciplined, you don't need motivation. But of course, right now you guys are getting motivated. And if you haven't taken action yet, make sure you get to it. All right, y'all. So the nightlife in Barcelona is crazy. Look, this is just the outside. This is to show you how many people go out. And this was on a Tuesday. 
Look at all these people. Literally got the club going up on a Tuesday. Yo, it was crazy out there. So we went out. Um, we went to Pasha. There's a strip. It has Pasha. It also has um, Shoko. And then it also has Opium. And it's on the beach. And they have all these clubs there. And then we ended up going to another club called Bling Bling, which is right here. And it was... It was a lot of people, great vibes, great music. I was over here on the hookah turning up, going crazy in the club. It was. Hey, candy for a baby. We doing it big. Yes, you already know we doing it big. Um, the bottle girls, oh my God, they was beautiful. I mean, this is my type right here. The one, the Balani, oof, she was she was real nice. But yeah, we we had to get the drinks, VIP section, get the night popping. You gotta get the pastries. Y'all already know you got the food, you got the pastries, you got all that. Yo, hey, we out here about to head to the pool party. It's about to be live. Right now, we gotta find a taxi. I'm getting real nervous because I already paid for the VIP sofa, and then like it's getting late, so we probably won't get there till eight. And I just run and I need to eat. Actually, I just ate. I be spitting bars. Y'all don't even know how far. Sometimes I be going crazy, but sometimes I get lazy and shit don't even phase me. But check it out.
Tonight is gonna be a movie though, for real. Y'all gonna see. Shorty said, why are you in Barcelona for your birthday? Listen, dude. <laughs> Barcelona is fucking... We, we be in Miami all the time, so that shit get old. But now we in Europe. Like, we like seeing the, the foreigns. We like, they look... They my speed to the max. I mean, I'm all the way in the fucking fast lane on their ass, nigga. That shit be... I'm ready. I'm ready to rumble. <laughs> We're gonna keep it PG because when I say other stuff, you two like to uh, like the bandage right now. Right now we're starving like Marvin, so we're ready to see what's going on. We got a little bit of ooh that's choosing, but I ain't gonna lie, like the coach out here, they choose real quick. They're not like DR where they're gonna snap the neck. They're gonna look at you real quick and that's it. Look at it. They just look real quick and that's it. But um, you gotta do a lot of work if you're out here. They're gonna give you choosing signals. They're not gonna like snap the neck like they are. And when they get the choosing signals, you just run down on it. When you run down on it, stay yourself. If you're American, they like that shit. Don't fucking switch up and try to be Spanish and be something you're not. I'm gonna talk to her like a real nigga. Yo, what's good? What are you doing? I'm gonna be not about to, but I'm out.
All right, y'all. So the nightlife in Sitges is very, very underrated. Okay, so they got a whole strip of bars and it's, it's ladies everywhere. I'm talking about the female to male ratio is crazy. It's, I would say, at least four girls to one guy. And we went to this little bar. Um, like I said, it's a stripper bar, and it was this girl. She was choosing me. I'm going up talking to her, and then her friend was trying to block, man. They always be blocking, but she wasn't with that. She's like, man, watch out. Like, I see what I like. I need to I need to at least do something. So she wanted to dance on me. I was, I was trying to tell bro, like, bro, chill out. Like, you know, we just chilling. She's ready. Like, why are you stopping her? So, you know, we was just vibing. She was pretty as hell. Um, I love Spanish women. Spanish women are very beautiful to me, especially the European Spanish women. But this club was nice. They had good music, good vibes. It was just, honestly, I, I like it a little bit better. I mean, if you want to really ball out, you go to Barcelona. But like Sidges, I think you can have a higher conversion rate. Um, it's just a better opportunity if you're trying to do something. We're out here right now in Barcelona Beach. Sunday, it's pretty packed. It goes down. There's people, people all the time. The whole little beach post. We're gonna kick it for a little bit, then we got a little yacht party for my birthday. So yeah, it's gonna be a good time. Man. Thank you all for watching. Make sure y'all hit that like, hit that subscribe button. We're doing the content for y'all. Tap it. Yeah. Real, real, real relaxed, you know what I'm saying? Just about to enjoy the vibe out, see what things hit on. A lot of great things have happened so far. Eric, you about to pop his cherry, let's go. trip it's been smooth we've been partying it's been the party olympics but we had to rest up last night we was about to die heart was beating crazy i'm talking tuesday wednesday thursday friday saturday sunday just going ham now we finally headed back what you think kev you you tired i'm ready to come back how soon how soon So a year. It's gonna take us a year. <laughs> All right, we'll see you Spain in a year. If you're thinking, listen, y'all, I'm right here right now. If you look amazing and then you're like have a lot of money and but your mindset is like fucked up. So tell them, Mika, you said they gotta work on the mindset. Hell no, I'm a camera shy though. She camera shy, but she said you gotta work on your mindset as a man. You you should. What else should you do? Yeah, like that's like number one. That's number one. Okay, number one. So stick to your purpose, fellas. You're hearing it straight from me and straight from her. 